Hello everybody and welcome to Memphis, Tennessee on this August the 16th and I'm going to show you how and when I trim back my irises. You see there's a clump there and I had a clump here. So I guess you could say it's late summer here. I was going to say spring but it's late summer. So I've cut these back about a week and a half ago and as you can see they're already growing back the reason I cut them back is because let's walk over here and see they all just kind of look tacky after a while they start getting brown uh, tips and getting clumped together and I just think it looks better personally to cut them back and it doesn't hurt them especially during the summertime so these are the weapons of choice I use either the good scissors or these either one sometimes you get blisters from those these you don't and I do like these these are extra sharp these are Corona and those are just Fiskars which are great Either way, they're both fine. Okay, I cut, cut them all back except for one so I can show you what I do. And I'll talk about it for a second. If you can see this one, what I do is cut them a couple inches off the ground, two to three, maybe, maybe shorter, I don't know. Anyway, I try to cut them in a fan shape, go across and then hopefully you can see there. Let's see, uh, maybe here. I just try to bevel the ends, make it like a fan. And I'll show you why in a few minutes. I was taught that by an older lady that grew irises. I used to just cut them straight, but she said, cut them like a fan. So let me show you. All right, I'm gonna do this with one hand, hopefully. Grab my scissors. And we're just gonna cut them straight across like that and then I'm gonna bevel this and bevel that oh my gosh that's a beautiful fan that's what you want all right so this is the other side that I cut back a few weeks ago and as you can see all the new growth is gonna come up from the middle and then another couple of weeks it's they're gonna look nice but your main goal is to have them looking good for the fall so that you can enjoy their beautiful leaves and then to get them ready in the winter so that they'll look good for the spring but anyway this is just so that they'll look nice because they were looking ugly in my view I don't like that and just a little bit of work they could look nice for the fall so that's what I do, and it works. Thanks.